Hello. Well, it was a mostly fine day on Saturday, but it's all changed as Storm Kira is set to hit, bringing wet and very windy to all parts of the UK in time for Sunday. We do have a number of warnings in force. We have this yellow wind warning covering the whole of the UK. We could quite widely see gusts of 60 to 70 miles per hour, even up to 80 miles per hour in some places. But it's under this amber area, which covers the bulk of England and Wales, where we're most likely to see the significant impacts. We could see damage to property, as well as some flying debris, which does bring the risk of injuries. And on top of that, there's going to be some disruption to travel and also some power outages. The reason for this is because of Storm Kira. It's currently in the Atlantic, but it's going to sweep in as we go through Sunday, bringing wet and windy weather to all parts. Once it clears away, though, we'll have colder air feeding its way in across the UK. And with some showers, that does bring the fairly significant risk of some snow across northern parts of the UK. Back to Saturday evening, though, and it's already a wet start across western parts, but that rain will spread to all areas. So for the bulk of the UK, it is going to turn very wet, very windy as we go through the night, perhaps staying dry for longest down towards the southeast, and notice also some sleet and snow mixed in with the rain across northern parts of Scotland. Here it's likely to turn quite chilly tonight, but elsewhere temperatures not dropping much due to the wind and rain. Sunday then, a very wet, very windy day. We're going to have swathes of wet weather pushing their way across heavy downpours, the heaviest rain perhaps likely over the highest ground of Western England and Wales, where we could see some localised flooding, and the strongest winds, like I mentioned, particularly across England and Wales, where the greatest impacts are likely. Temperatures, well, they're well above average for the time of year, but when you factor in the wind and rain, it's really not going to feel especially mild. Later on on Sunday, then, we'll see the worst of the rain clearing away, but plenty of showers feeding in from the west then. And we've got this colder air coming in too. As a result, we do see the likelihood of some pretty intense snowfall across parts of Scotland in particular. And as a result, we have a wind and snow warning valid here, which covers through all of Monday and all of Tuesday as well. Quick look towards the rest of Monday then, and wintry showers affecting parts of Scotland. With the wind, we're likely to see blizzards here. Elsewhere, yes, it is a dry and brighter day than on Sunday, but temperatures markedly lower and still some very strong winds around, especially towards the southwest. Remember, there's always more information about all those warnings that we've got coming up due to Storm Kira on both the Met Office website, our app, and all of our social media channels. See you later.